Yeah, good afternoon. Welcome to Project Land Port again here. And uh, today we've been another exciting chapter in the trials we're installing here. We've been um, putting our um, low disturbance work in at two different depths. And Philip Wright's here, and Philip's just going to explain what we're finding and, um, and um, how we set the machine up. Okay, so uh, what we've done really is, is first of all to check the effect of the, uh, the pre-compaction that David's put in and anything else that's there and we've determined really that we're going to be needing to be working to get rid of all of it at about 20 centimetres but what we don't want to do is boil the soil up and lose all the natural column support and you can see in here what we've here's where the legs been we're working to nominally about 20 centimetres down here but in the middle, this is this is directly between the legs. Is if I just ease that look, you can see we've we've got some good cracks down through there. So although we're not actually moving the entire profile, shearing it at depth, we're putting in cracks. So we're putting in drainage channels, we're putting in pathways for roots to get down there and grow, and for water to drain through if we get a lot of rainfall. So we're basically setting the land up for the cover crop roots to start to do their work and they can penetrate down and they then can start to work into these blocks and open them up and do the, the real job of restructuring. As so I just move that out of the way, you can see here we've got those natural columns left. So we've got support. When we traffic over that with a drill, for example, we've still got support in these. But you can see them starting to break open now. They're a little bit tight because we've got, we're on a headland and we've got compaction, but we're actually achieving the job that basically we've set out to do. Fantastic. 